Hey, Audrey, can you tell us about your connections with Kansas City? My connection to Kansas City. Well, I was born and raised in Kansas City. I started theater in high school at Raytown South High School. And then I went to Truman State, which was Northeast Missouri State. And I had the opportunity to work with Guerrilla Theater, Tom Stoffel Theater, and Comedy Sports when I was in town. And I can't wait to reconnect with everyone. What are you most excited about to get into Casey Fringe and with the first live festival in a few years? I am so excited to come back to my hometown. And that's that's where I started doing theater. And I, I was there for a few years after college and just reconnect with the vibrant artistic community that's there that I have visited from time to time when I'm home visiting my family but really to dive in and be a part of it and make new friends and collaborators. I'm so excited to get to know everybody and everyone on the Fringe Festival team and the volunteers that I've met and worked with so far are awesome. And I think part of that is Cheryl's wonderful, inspirational energy and uh, dynamics. So I'm happy, happy to follow in her footsteps and get to work with her in the future. My question is, do you hang your bathroom tissue over or under? You know, I only ask the most important questions. Hi, Richie. That is a very important question. I have to say that normally I hang my toilet paper over. However, this guy, which is my new kitten, Jax, born in May, I now have to hang it under. Otherwise, he will roll out the toilet paper roll. If your life were a friend show, what would it look like? All right. If my life, Cheryl, was a friend show, it would definitely be multimedia. And it would have a mix of comedy and drama. Um, there would be some visual spectacle, and definitely physical comedy. My question for you is, it seems that throughout your career, you have been influenced by the arts. How far back does it go? Were you a child who just loved movies? Or where did that influence sort of begin? And when did you fall in love with the arts? Okay, so... How I got interested in art is I went to this amazing preschool called Alpha Preschool in Raytown. And it was, uh, my, my teachers were so excited about art of any kind. Um, and it really, it just caught on for me, that energy, the joy, the playfulness, the way everyone connected to work on whether it's drawing or painting or a puppet show or singing or playing instruments. We just had so much fun. And I always associated art with fun and pleasure. And then when I was in high school, um, I auditioned for the dance team and I didn't get into it. And when we saw the list, my best friend left me at school ran off in tears and left me. And there I was looking for a ride home. And I found a friend who is auditioning for this show. And I asked the teacher if I could just sit in and wait for him while he auditioned. And he's, we were, they were doing um, By the Skin of Our Teeth by Thornton Wilder, which it has a huge cast. And so the teacher said, well, I could sit in there, but I had to audition. So I did. And I got five little parts. I think I had three lines and I just found my home, my uh, friends and the playfulness and the connection. And I love disappearing into another person's life and getting to think and be and behave in ways that I myself would never behave. And I think that's really when I caught the bug for theater and I've never looked back. (laughs) 